Well, that was really something. I'll say. King George sure learned a valuable lesson about being selfish. He sure did. In fact, the next day, he went around his kingdom giving his old duckies away to anyone who wanted one, so they could be happy too. Wow. We're over here by QWERTY to talk about what we've learned today. And so what we have learned applies to our lives today. And God has a lot to say in his book. What? Hey, you wouldn't let us do the show. We gotta do something. Oh, all right. You see, we know that. God's word is for everyone. Now that our song is done, we'll take a look. A look. Take it, Bob. <clears throat> King George learned that being selfish, like when we want to take something that belongs to someone else, or when we won't share the things that belong to us, well, it hurts the people around us. That's right, Bob. Hey, let's see if Cordy had the verse. Good idea, Larry. <laughs> hmm. Love each other as brothers and sisters, and honor others more than you do yourself. Romans 12, 10. So the Bible says that instead of just trying to honor ourselves or make ourselves happy, we should think about the people around us, about our friends at school or our brothers and sisters. What could we do that would make them feel good? Lucy Thomas of Bismarck, North Dakota, I bet it would make your sister very happy if you would share your toys with her. I think so too, Bob. Well, we're out of time for today, so remember, kids. God made you special, and he loves you very much. Hey, Bob, if it's okay with you, some friends of ours would like to take the next show. What? Hello, I am Bob Di Tomato. And I am Larry. <laughs> I don't feel good about that. Goodbye! Wait, huh? visit us at www.VeggieTales.com.